Alrighty and alrighty. Okay, Pearl is prepared here. Okay, so should be good to go. Alright, so good morning once again. Um, this here is gonna be another Gems of War video. And um this is about the uh, new new mini game world event. I don't Yeah, I think it's called World Event. But anyway, um changing the weather. Um and I am kind of uh, in a bit of a rush right now. Um I'm this is kind of an in progress run. Um it just kinda of occurred to me, hmm, maybe I should do a video about this. And, uh, I still have a cast video to, I still have a cast video to do here in about half hour, 45 minutes, so I'm gonna try to keep this short, so, but anyway, um, in the background, and I'll probably play this for my cast video as well, um, I think, I think this is a brand spanking new live stream channel here, Doom Radio, <laughs> beats to rip and tear to, rip and tear until it is done, you know, that kind of thing, so, so, I mean, yeah, so yeah, it's some metal music. Sorry if this is offensive to anybody, but, like, this is just what I'm into right now. You know? Oh, and let me back up, let me back up. And, um, looking at the description, looking at the, um, looking at the description, I don't, it didn't say anything about this music being copyrighted. In fact, uh, let me double check this real quick. Because this... Strikes me as a kind of music that would be. So, I'm checking that right now. Okay. Permission has been granted by the rightful owners of the music being streamed in this live stream. Either directly or by the license of the cop. Ooh. It says copyrighted material on here, so... Um, I'm still looking, yeah, to be on the safe side, I'm just gonna go ahead and switch it. <sighs> yeah, it, it, it's, it's, it, basically the implication here is that some of the music in here is copyrighted, <sighs> but... Fuck it. I'll just go ahead and leave it at this channel. Um, copyright be damned. I don't want. I don't want to go hopping around trying to find something that isn't copyrighted. So, I'll just go with this. And let me turn it down from my end. Okay. So anyway, um, changing the weather. Weather in Stormheim was dreadful. However, so friendly vocal chat. Blah 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 blah. blah. Defeat enemies and collect lanterns, okay? And I already went to the shop and I bought the first three tiers. Um, I kind of got tripped up by the images here. You know, I, I thought if you if you buy this, I thought it meant it gave you a medal, an actual medal, not a, not a token. So but let me back out. I do have this, so. And um. And like I said, this is an in-progress run. And typically, usually I just go for whichever whichever one has the highest level. Um, for my team, uh, I'm a goblin kind of guy, so... Oh, and the restrictions? You can only pick either generator or mage, and the mana color is blue. Which is great for me, because this is one of my favorite teams right here. Like I said, I'm a goblin kind of person. King Gob Truffle is pretty much a mainstay in most of my builds um, same thing here ocean tome it just it just um, goes really good with this group I mean I got blue allies and elemental allies he's an elementalist and recently I got level 100 so I mean the frozen I might want to fix that in fact let me go ahead and do that I don't I don't know if there are any other uh, better options but doesn't really look like it matters. Lesser of the three evils. Lesser of the three evils. So, and uh, normally, and hopefully I'll remember to switch this back when I go do PvP, but I'm, uh, I'm going from Fortitude into Lord of Storms. 
because I'm pretty sure some of these enemies are probably going to be in the level 200s, so I'm going to need the uh, gradual ramp up of extra damage. And then, um, being able to hit them all with uh, four effects at once here, stun, freeze, burn, and tangle is always nice. And again, it's, it's going to be almost mandatory with some of the higher level stuff that I'll be doing. But again, going back to here, a mainstay in most all my builds. King Gob, Forest Troll. Not my ideal choice. I've, I've said this in, uh, other, in other videos, but in order for this to be useful, I already have to have a bunch of green gems on the board. But if I don't, he's basically, basically going to sit and collect dust. I would say uh, at least 12 gems on the board. Even then, it's kind of, kind of iffy. So, but anyway, this is what I got. So let me go ahead and um, do a bit of a demo run here. Oh, and one more thing I need to do. Come on. board and that blows fourteen should be a bit safe here yep Arcturian. I don't really know the difference between these, like Ice Troll and Arcturian, but in these, in these other mini games that I've done, kind of the same thing. I don't know if there's like a some kind of ranking system, like I have to go with one over the other. Gonna be a rinse and repeat. Oh, all that, not a single four match. Here we go. 101. Now, if it comes to it, I actually did this in the uh, the raid boss, but when it gets to where battles are going to take so extremely long, I'll actually spend extra... Oops, wrong one. Spend extra uh, sigils, you know, just for the uh, damage buff to speed things along, because otherwise I'll be there forever. Better check for any fours or fives, which there are none. Ooh, 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 ooh. I'll do that though. There we go. That's a whole sea of green right there.
114, ramping up. Board. There we go. But like I said, uh, I don't use the forest troll until I have at least 12 gems on the board. And even then, 12 and 13, it's kind of gray area. Because earlier, because of uh, doing it when there's fewer is actually dangerous because you're you run the risk of uh, giving your opponent free green matches is what you're doing. So 127. I think I've uh, I've seen battles as high as 250 ish. So. Something else too. Um, those that are those that have heard of it, the Mirage Queen. I would have thought that it would be a generator or a mage as well, but I'm thinking it's uh, must be a damage dealer or something. Too bad too. I would love to have had her in this group. Forty, still going up. Nope, that is unsafe. And um, that's something else. That was something else. Um, I'm guessing those snowflakes that you're seeing, they kind of work like uh, like Captain P gems. Whenever you match them, destroy them. I think even explode them. Um, they're yeah, they kind of work like those burning gems. If you match them or destroy them, explode them or whatnot, it's gonna freeze somebody at random. Great if you're the one doing the matching, but if you're on the receiving end of it, especially with a goblin build like mine, I'm up shit creek without a paddle if I get hit with one of those. Alright, uh, so now we're back to this. But anyway. Anyway, I just want to do a quick demo of that. So just give people a give people a little idea of how it works and also um apologies on this normally when i do these i try to start slow like like uh shoot the game speed to like half so anybody that's never played this game before or can at least could at least have a bit of a see what 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 could actually see what the hell's going on you know so so again sorry about this but I was also in a, I'm also in a bit of a hurry too, because like I said, I have a cast video that I still have to get taken care of as well. So, yeah. But anyway, although anyway, um, 
totally forgot what I was going to say. Oh, yeah. Th thanks for watching, everybody. I appreciate it, and I'll see you all next time. Bye for now.